Have you ever wondered what it would be like to have a conversation with your digital self, the artificially intelligent version of you? Now, you hear people saying, hey Siri, where's the nearest pizza joint? Or remind me to pick up the kids at four o'clock. But you seldom hear people saying, hey Siri, how can I become the very best version of myself? Now, for my day job, I work with non-technical people, non-programmers, and I try to help them um, gain access to things like artificial intelligence. So I basically say to them, we're gonna build a, a Siri for your business. Now, the reason for doing this is it, that it creates a single point of entry to one version of the truth for all the employees. One of the interesting side benefits that I've noticed is that employees do love talking to the chatbot. So they're typically talking to the chatbot about the business. Um, a lot of what they're talking about are what the AI is predicting is gonna happen in the future. So it's kind of a lot of fun for them. So I want you to imagine something. What if instead of creating a record of company information, so instead of having an event log of transactions and stuff like that, we kept a personal digital shadow. So in other words, we let our AI have permission to look at everywhere we've been, everyone we've spoken to, everyone that they know by accessing something like LinkedIn, um, every text, email, document that we've both sent and received. If we allowed it to, it could even listen to our phone conversations or even our voice conversations in a meeting and convert that voice into text and put that into the uh, digital shadow. If other people allow us, it could even put their voice into our digital shadow as well. So you can imagine the AI becoming quite rich and being able to predict our future events. What if we also told the AI about our personal goals, about our personal vision, about our purpose for living? The AI could do one specific job, it could keep predicting areas of untapped potential. In other words, it can help keep you as healthy as possible. If by health, we mean physical health, mental health, emotional health, financial health, and maybe even spiritual health. Now, if we wanted to, we could open up to other experts and get them to help us out, overcome some of our challenges. But interestingly, I think there'll be a side benefit. I think people would quite enjoy just having a chat, having a conversation with the digital version of themselves. Um, I think what you'll probably hear in the not too distant future is someone saying uh, to their digital self, so what is stopping me from becoming the very best version of myself? And then I think the AI will show their calendar and it will show the next week's schedule and activities that are bad for you will be in red, activities that are good for you will be in green. There might be a flashing blue one, which is something you haven't thought about doing. Uh, for instance, it might be saying, hey, next Tuesday, Ted is having this three minute pitch session. Why don't you tell all the Ted people about us? That's my pitch. Thanks for listening.